at the Pack Horse Fair in Bruton today, uh, talking to people about the general election. And what's really clear is that when you look at the Green Stall and the Labour Stall, there's been so much excitement. People are excited about the ideas that they're going to be voting for. People are excited to be fighting back over austerity. They're excited that those ideas are now part of the debate. And they're excited that we're standing up for the environment. They care about these things and they want to vote for the party which is going to represent their interests. And that's in contrast to the people who come up and say, yeah, I'm going to vote tactically for the Lib Dem. Because they're not excited about anything. They're just voting to do the best they think they can do in a situation where they've kind of given up hope. And what's really great about this election is it may be an ambush. It may be too hard for us to organise to unseat the Tory this time. That's possible. But what it has happened is that we've started to get our political parties revitalised and say, do you know what matters? What matters is the principles. We think it's important to, to act on the environment. We think it's important to end the austerity and we're going to organise and we are going to change it and I'm going to make sure that my vote counts towards that in this election to build for the future and make sure that we really do have a society that cares about our children instead of this ridiculous situation where we're all being dragged down by the narrow self-interest of a few wealthy elite people who are corrupting our political system destroying the fabric of our communities and now threatening our existence on this planet. So whatever you do in this election, make sure you vote for what you believe in so that we can build up for the fight back, which isn't going to end on June the 9th. It's just going to begin.